Welcome to another ABS online video. Let's go and find out what we're going to learn today. Hello again everyone. It's so exciting 27. So why? Why so exciting? Hmm, very exciting. Well, we are near the end of our course. Oh dear. Well, hold on. Don't be sad. Don't be sad. It's not going to be the end of everything, is it? No. That will be very sad. But you will be ready for the next step. Oh, okay. That sounds exciting now, doesn't it? There we are. He's taking the next step. But hold on. Let's not forget our most important question. Yeah, hello. How are you? What can we say? Do you remember all four of them? I am fine. I am good. I am great. And one more. I am wonderful. Now, do you remember? I always say I am great. But what are you going to say today? You shout out a nice good answer. Here we go. Hello. How are you? Okay, well that was a good answer. So, what do we mean next step? Hmm. Well, learning English is like going upstairs. There we are. He's going up the stairs. When you are ready to take the next step, you go up and up and up and up. Maybe you never reach the top, but it's very important to keep going up. Keep taking the next step. And you are so close to that next step. Hooray! Yes, so the end of your school year means that you're ready to take the next step into the new school year. Now that's not yet, but we are very nearly there. Wow! So, let's look at this week. Oh, whoa, oh, hold on. Slow down. What about last week? It's always good to try and remember last week. Hmm, what did we do? We used the special E again. It made a big I sound. It really is my favourite letter. It's so helpful. There he is. Such a special, small letter. So, do you remember some of the words? Let's see. We've got F, I, V. We know what happens here. F, I, V. Five. Great, that one's an easy word. T, I, M. There he is. Our specially is working hard again to give us the word time. Five and time. Great, well done, magic special E. Do you remember our story? 
I thought last week was very funny. We met a special pig. I don't think he was very lazy. He was funny. He would sing at the sun. Hmm, I've never seen a singing pig. But he did not sing at night. Maybe he was just very happy when he was in the nice warm sun. He didn't like the night time. Maybe it was too cold for him. Okay, time for this week's words. What are they going to be this time? It's the special E again. Great! Well, we know what it does. There it is, the special E. It looks very big there, doesn't it? But really, silent. No sound at all. We made the big A. Then we made the big I. Hmm. Now it's time to make the big O. That is big. Wow. Okay. So we know how it works. We're going to have an O. And it's going to turn into an O. Let's look at the words. How many do you think we will have this week? Let's go and find out. We know how the sound is made, so let's just get the words. Here we are. N O S Nose Nose B O N Bone Bone K O N Cone Cone And I think we've got room for one more H O M Home Home Well that's great Now I think nose and bone and home They're super words I think we know them But the word cone Actually, it's a shape. It's sort of like a triangle, but at one end, it's a circle. A cone is what we use to put ice cream in. Mmm, good shape to remember. So, it's a triangle that turns into a circle. Whew, that sounds a bit strange, but I'm sure you can think about what shape it is. Cone, cone, good and very useful shape. More words, more, great. So we've already had four words. How many more? R, O's, rows, rows. Own stone stone. Ah, we need to think about this one. P H. That does not make p h. P H makes a f sound. So this is f own phone. Phone. We see PH making a F sound in the word elephant. We don't say elephant, it's elephant. And here, F phone. 
phone. Have we got room for just one more? Yes. G -l -o -b. Globe. Globe. How many is that? Four plus four is eight. Eight great words with the big O sound. Let's use some clues this week. So, do you remember what is a clue? A clue is a little bit like a definition. It's a sentence that helps us guess what the word is. Can you guess the word? Hmm. So here's the clue. Use it to speak to grandmother. What O word is that? You just shout out the answers, guys, if you know. Ah. P H F O N. Phone. Phone. We use the phone to speak to grandmother. That was a good clue. Let's keep guessing. Oh, this is one of my favourite things to do. We put ice cream in this. Well, we put ice cream into my mouth and my tummy, but they are not O words. What is the shape? K O N. Cone. Cone. Ice cream in a cone. When the ice cream is with me, it doesn't stay in the cone for very long. Let's look at some more. Guess another one. This is the most beautiful flower. What's that? We have many beautiful flowers, but this one is the r o s rose, rose. It is very beautiful, but be careful. It's got some really sharp, spiky things on the stem. So maybe we should just look at it. Rose, rose. I don't think there's anything more beautiful than that this week. But let's have a look. Guess another one. It's right in the middle of your face. Well, you just put your hand on your face. And what are you touching? I think this one's easy. N O S Nose. Your nose is right in the middle of your face. I hope it is anyway. I hope it's not next to your ear. Hmm. That would look a bit unusual. Hmm. So, your nose is right in the middle. Guess another one. This is a small rock. So it's just the same as a rock, but smaller. What is it? St -o -n stone. Stone. There we are. Now, 
rocks and stones are many, 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 many different sizes. So when do we say stone and when do we say rock? Hmm, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe you could say it's a big rock, a small rock, a big stone, a small stone. But I think it's up to you. Is it a stone or is it a rock? Oh dear, what a very difficult question. Maybe there's no answer. Stone. Guess again. There are two in your arm and two in your leg. Hmm. I think there are many all over your body. What is it? B bone. 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 There we are. Wow. Now, there are more than two in your arms, more than two in your legs. There are so many because some of them are really small. Some of them are really long. Feel the top of your leg. That long bone goes all the way down to your knee. And then there's another bone. Oh, there's so many. There are hundreds of bones in our body. Maybe later you can try and find out the number. Bone. There's another one. You can see the whole world on this ball. Oh, okay, that one's a bit more difficult. What is it? G, L, O, B. Globe, globe. I think a globe is really interesting to look at. So many countries, so many different places I would like to visit. You can see them all on the globe. There's another one. How many have we had now? I've lost count. Let's look at this clue. This is the best place in the world. Hmm, where do you think it is? I know. H O M Home Home It really is the best place in the world. I love my home. Is that it? Have we had eight words? I think so. I might be wrong. Let's have a look. Yes, well done. You know the words so well. Try and use them. Maybe... Uh, I should give you a spelling test. Yes, what a good idea. Look at that. Do you want a spelling test? No. Okay, no spelling test. Yep, yeah. oh, all right. I will listen to you and no spelling test. Maybe next week. Yes, no, okay. Let's get on to our story. The boy in the castle has so many animals. We have already met a duck, 
and a pig. The duck had a problem. Oh, the pig was really special. Don't forget to look for words we have seen in our time together. Let's see. I think we've got duck, pig, what else? Time, mm, great words. Oh, he's looking very, very carefully. Did he see any more? Hmm. All of those words we've used many, many times. Let's read. Hmm. What's going to happen this week? The Queen. Oh, great. She's very beautiful. The Queen likes animals too. She likes to drink tea with the deer. Oh, that's unusual. What words have we got? Tea, deer, queen. We've used all of those words. We've used the words, but I don't think we have ever had tea with the deer. But that's what the Queen likes to do. She often ate cheese with a chicken. And sometimes sat on a gate with a snake. Wow! She doesn't like to look at the animals. She really likes to be with the animals. Tea with the deer, cheese with the chicken, and sitting on the gate with the snake. Wow! She did not like small things. Oh, okay. I think I agree. The bee and the bug made her run. Oh dear. Bee, bug, run. More of our special super words. Do you like small things? Hmm. To keep the bug away, she would have a big bird on her arm. Very good idea. That is a very scared bug. Good thinking, Queen. She is a nice Queen. Yes. She doesn't just look at the animals. She likes to be with them. I'm sure the animals like to be with the Queen. We saw more strange animals. Yes, we did. A chicken that eats cheese. A deer that drinks tea. My word, very strange. There they are. We saw more of our words. Snake, chicken, deer, gate, tea. Wow! Bird. Oh, so many. So many. One day we will have to count our words. There are a lot. So let's look at our big O words. We had eight just this week. Nose. Nose. Bone. Bone. Cone. Cone. H. 
home. Home. Four more. Rose. Rose. Stone. Stone. Phone. Phone. One more. Globe. Globe. Eight great words. All given to us by our special E. Thank you, special E. Super job, guys. We only have three more weeks together. I know, it is sad. It is very sad. But they are three great weeks. Yay! So don't be sad. Our three weeks are great. So, see you soon, guys. Let's go and meet our final two friends. Here they are. They are here to say thank you. See you next time. Bye. Thank you for watching our video today. Please don't forget, subscribe, and that will help us to make lots more videos for you. Thank you. Bye.